Okay, we'll start with the Partridge of Redditch, uh, Dry Fly Supreme, size 16. We've got some Shear, 14 aught, black. And we just attach this one, super slender body here. So we just want to go and we want to leave a little bit of the bend showing. So about halfway through the hook shank, uh, through the, the between the bend and the point. So that's good. We've got some crow secondary two secondary fibers just attach those and we go back up again I can trim that off then we want to make three four five six About 12 turns on that. Attach our Heichel pliers. And then we'll wrap this crow body. Do us there. And then we swap over. With our tying thread, we take one turn over the fibers and we lock it off. Then we can remove that. Just turn our vice that way so I don't cut my tying thread. Get rid of that. Then what we want is two matching. Uh, wood pigeon secondary uh, wing quills and we just want to take off a little wing and match these up back to back we want a little a wing that goes about the length of the hook pull those in and we go back That's good. And we just trim off this like so. And what we want is a starling. Uh, you can use a black, small black hen hackle if you like, but uh, a starling shoulder hackle. And we want to prepare that like so. We'll just come in. And tack this in forward. And lift that up. Probably best if I just put a, a turn behind that to pull it away from the hook eye. Good. One more there. I can get rid of that with the hackle pliers. There we go. Then we need a hackle plier on here. Fold the hackles back and We'll just wind those in. Need to move that back a little bit more. There we are. Just go around like so. And 
I'll swap that tying thread around the back. Hold that in position. Couple of turns. Turn that that way. Remove that. Need a little varnish. Which we'll just put on there. Wait finisher. One more. Remove that. Give it a coat of varnish. And that's it. That's the finished black nut wet fly. If you enjoyed the videos please like, share, subscribe and thanks for watching.